Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. So today I am doing a little something different. So my face is already made up because I'm actually getting ready to head out the door to my oldest son's um, big, one of his big football games. So, um, you know, me and the boys, I'm loading up the car and we're going to enjoy a little bit of band, listen to a little bit of Battle of the Bands tonight. We're going to one of the biggest games. So I wanted to just, you know, hop on here and show you guys a few things. So this video is about makeup that I have hit pan or it's been a repurchase, 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 or the bottle is empty and I've repurchased it already and probably getting ready for another repurchase. So always I'm excited to be here with you guys and you know, school is in full swing. We've actually had two weeks of school and I'm loving my class and they're so sweet. They're so stinking cute. But as I have to do, I'm always gonna keep up with my blog and I'm always gonna try to keep up with my YouTube channel. So on here today, like I said, I'm just gonna share some things where I've hit pan and those things have been some really big favorites of mine. Some of these things are um, still in rotation and you can purchase them. And some of them you may have to dig a little bit. So there was actually a palette that I wanted that I had to dig for. It's actually limited edition by Wet n Wild. And the formula on the Wet n Wild shadows have just gotten so freaking amazing. But the palette was called, it was a little tiny four palette. Um, it was a little tiny, I thought I had it right here laying in front of me. It was a little tiny four palette called Asta La Costa Baby. And it had a really pretty blue in there. Some really pretty colors, a purple, a blue, kind of like a little cupcake type um, light light a transition shade to go in the crease but it's limited edition and you can only find it in places like eBay and um, just some of those little odd places maybe even Poshmark I'm not sure but um, I definitely am trying to get my hands on that so if you know where that is leave me a comment down below in the comment section so let's get started so the first thing I want to show you and I think you've seen this in my videos is this right here dragon fruit which is a blush and this was purchased at five and below as you can tell i've hit pan on this and this is one of my absolute favorite blushes they are not making this anymore this is actually discontinued but i'm so sad because this color is so gorgeous and i just love this color on my cheeks i don't have this color on today i'm actually just wearing the wet and wild uh, mellow wine color with another um wet and wild uh cream blush underneath but this right here is just so gorgeous and i love it and i'm just sad that they're not making this anymore so i'm just trying to be careful about the last little bit i have to use my second thing that um that is now hit pan is this right here which is by prestige Cos cosmetics and it's illuminating bronzing powder and i've just loved using this it is in uh the color called sun kissed and i don't think that they're making this anymore they have some current ones but i have not tried them so this was purchased at ulta and i really really like this of course you can see i'm like at the bottom but the new one that i'm using though and i will tell you guys i'm liking a lot is the um where is it it was right here in front of me the new one that i'm using is the butter bronzer in the color deep bronzer by physicians formula which i absolutely love that but this video is not about what i'm currently using this video is about things that i've hit pan on and that have just changed the game for me in the makeup world this is a really nice formula if you've never heard of prestige cosmetics i say look them up they have some really nice gems um going on so give that a try my Second um, thing, this is actually empty, but this is a second repurchase. It is the Milani Prime Perfection Face Primer. It is oil-free because I'm a combo oily girl and this is empty. It really creates a very smooth canvas for your makeup. And I really like this formula. And um, this has just changed the game for me with my makeup because I really get kind of oily in my T-zone. And this has just done a really good job for me so definitely check this out very inexpensive you can even find this on the milani website or at your local cbs my next thing that i've hit pan on and this is an oldie but goodie and this is the anastasia beverly hills contour cream kit and they have uh this one here i've hit pan let me open this for you back to this my card of course my memory card just ran out so excuse me guys i had to switch memory cards on you but i'm back so 
The next repurchase I've had, this is my second bottle of the Mario Badescu Facial Spray. And this hit empty for me and it is amazing. I'm telling you, you will not be disappointed. Go and get this Mario Badescu Spray in Aloe and Cucumber and Green Tea. So, so nice and smells so, so good. Oh, oh I just love this stuff. So good. Um, the next thing that I have right here is that I've hit pan on, and this is from the ColourPop line. It is called the Color Avalon in Super Shock Cheek. And this is kind of like a bronzy kind of gold. Um, when I'm really wearing dramatic kind of gold fall eyes, I usually put this right here to kind of highlight my cheek, and it is so, so, so gorgeous. Um, they do still sell um, their Super Shock Cheek um, highlighters. And I say give them a try. They're very inexpensive, very affordable, and the brand is a wonderful brand, wonderful, wonderful brand, especially if you're budgeting your makeup. I say give this a try. This is in the color Avalon, but I'll link all this stuff down below for you just so you'll have easy access to click to that particular brand. Um, this right here, you guys know my oldie but goodie. This is the Coty Airspun Loose Face Powder. It's translucent. Um, I love this. I thought this would make me break out, but it's actually done a really good job on my face. Um, this right here is just a trans. Oops. This right here is just a translucent powder. This is a repurchase, and this is my second one. You can purchase this at CVS or Walgreens, if I'm not mistaken. And it is under six dollars, and I love it. And it does an amazing job. I will probably not say it is as amazing as my Maybelline Fit Me loose powder but this right here is really good especially when I'm going to school and I just need to grab something because I kind of use my Maybelline Fit Me when I'm going to more high-end occasions and this is more for my teacher occasions so try this out my next thing is my Z palette which comes from the line for uh it comes from the line from the Makeup Geek Shadows. If you've never heard of Makeup Geek, go try that, type it in. You're going to be blown away by Makeup Geek. Marlena is the um, is the um, producer of that line of makeup. She is, is pretty, pretty, pretty awesome. And I have a shade in here that I use a lot. And this one is called Creme Brulee. And it is one of my favorites. As you can see, her shadows are not very expensive. I want to say they're like maybe three to five bucks a shadow, which is not that bad. So you can fill this up over time. I have not even filled this up, but I definitely think it's worth trying. I do have another palette um, from the Makeup Geek line, and it's another Z palette that um, is dirty. But I love the colors from this line. And this one is called Chickadee. It's like one of those hidden colors that you use on your brow bone, kind of in the crease really really nice and this one as you can see is just about gone and this is called peach smoothie which is another one that is really really nice in that particular line and i absolutely adore it so we're getting through down to the bottom of my pan and bottles that i've repurchased or hit empty bottles on so this right here is the kat von d shade and light palette and this right here is was so amazing and I know that um, the, the, this Shea Von D palette is a little bit on the high end and this was purchased actually on eBay at the kind of middle range so you guys know how I feel about that high end makeup um, this was purchased at the middle range you can see right here I actually have three shadows that I've hit pan on Latinus, Citri and Liberatus and I've actually used this in a couple of my videos but let me share this with you. The Kat Von D palette, there is actually a dupe that is out for this palette that is so much cheaper. I want to say it is like 10 bucks or under $15. And it is being sold by Makeup Revolution. And they have, I'm, I'm telling you, it is an exact dupe. Do not spend your money on, and I think Kat Von D was pretty upset when um, this, this, that dupe came out and it was duped so well. So do not spend your money if you don't have to. Go and buy the dupe. And Makeup Revolution is sold in Ulta and it is phenomenal. I love this palette. But I just want to share with you that little hidden secret about the Shade Light palette. The dupe for it. The next thing that I have bought a repurchase was the Milani Eyeshadow Primer. Love this stuff. Absolutely love this stuff. 
it is one of those golden gems it's in the color nude and if you can get your hands on this i say get your hands on this you would absolutely love this primer for your eyes i don't understand if you're not priming your eyes what are you doing because your shadows will not sit still if you do not try to lock them in place with something and I always start with a primer before I start putting on shadows because I want those shadows to sit tight all day long and I'm getting ready to leave very soon and I actually have this primer on under this shadow on my eyes because I'm gonna be sitting outside I'm it's you know even though soon here the Sun's gonna be going down but I still want those shadows to stay put and be beautiful in their own right my next repurchase is this actually is my third tube of the l'oreal double extend beauty tube mascara there's a step one and a step two i always have said in my videos that i feel as though that my lashes do an even better job when they have a fiber when they not really a fiber but a primer when there's a primer attached to it and then this on top they just tend to just you know take their rightful place in the world <laughs> and I just love what it does and right now I'm currently um, I switch between a few I'm using the L'Oreal Lash Paradise they have a primer with that one and I am loving that as well I just feel as though for me my ally eyelashes do a better job when I put a primer on them and then when I go over them with something else they just perform better and let's see um, I have two more things that I want to share with you and then that kind of wraps up our time together but I have a repurchase here of the Maybelline Fit Me Matte Poreless of the co color 330 Toffee Caramel guys I'm holding these three bottles but there are four more in the restroom so this ought to tell you how I feel about Maybelline Fit Me foundation and just the quality it is so affordable you cannot beat that with a stick. I love it. But I also wanted to venture out and try some other found drugstore foundations that um, this reminds me. I just wanted to try some other drugstore foundations that I could share with you that I feel as though are very comparable or comparable to some very high-end foundations. This right here reminds me of the MAC Studio Fix Fluid. And, and I was in the color NC45, I remember. But... I have like seven eight nine bottles of this in my restroom and it is just one of those foundations that I will continue to repurchase because it has been very good to me and I love the price tag so great job on your part Maybelline the last thing that I'm gonna share with you in this video is my love for the physicians formula healthy foundation in the color DN3 I am so, so, so in love with this. This is actually what I'm wearing in this video, this Physicians Formula Foundation. They say it is for all skin types. It has a brightening complex in it, but I just feel like it holds so well. And um, the bottle is all that. This is an empty one. This is one of the newer bottles. And I just love how heavy it is. It is just so gorgeous. I mean, really, come on. This right here is just all that. And it is under 13 bucks, which I think is fairly reasonable. I mean, look at the packaging. Come on. Go ahead, Physicians Formula. Go ahead. I'm right there with you. So just keep that in mind. And, you know, that, you know, I wanted to share some things with you that have um, just been a little bit more tried and true for me. Things that I've kind of just loved and just, you know, has been a repurchase, a repurchase, a repurchase. Because if I'm spending my money on it, I'm definitely not going to share something with you that I feel as though that you shouldn't be spending your money on. So just love sharing, you know, good nuggets for you guys to have and walk away with. And, you know, um, that I just think that you'll really, really like. My next video that is coming up on this channel, I think you'll like it. I am going to be doing, doing a first floor home tour of our home and just walking with you and it's going to be a short video but walking with you through our home and just talking about I won't be going upstairs yet because I'm still working on the upstairs area but walking through our home with you and just showing you you know what place you know why this place is home for us and you know how we like our neighborhood and just the things that make it home for us and taking you through my kitchen my dining room my living room um, downstairs in the foyer taking you to the master bath and the master bedroom and just the places that we love to kind of hang out as a family and just kick back and be who we are 
so that is my very next video um in this series you know i try to bring you guys these videos on mondays and fridays my schedule got a little bit off but i think that i'm trying to get back in the swing of my schedule um i will be posting a blog post tomorrow because it is sunday and my blog posts do go out on sundays so keep up with me and follow my blog delightfully styled i'll link it down below in the comment box um also you guys know hit that thumbs up make sure you push that notification bell so you'll be notified every time i upload a video my little boy told me to tell you that cold hit that notification bell so that you can be notified every time a video comes up also subscribe and like to my channel i'm almost at a hundred subscribers i am five subscribers away from a hundred this journey has been exciting no matter how long i've been on it but it's been exciting always i enjoy you guys until our next video see you again soon bye